Bayek, what good fortune! I thought it would be years before we saw you again. Hail in peace, man ahead. How is your family? <laughs> the children seem to grow larger by the minute. My wife and I have our hands full. And you? Is there any news of... None. I forget myself. There are so many things in your life best not spoken of. Forgive me. I see by your garb that you have been promoted. Ah, yes. The High Priest, in his grace, made me his second. And my rank is not the only thing he has changed. You must see the temple. You will give me a tour? Of course, of course. At the moment of your pleasure. Ready to see our beautiful temple? After you, Menehet. Or is it servant of the goddess? Menehet will do for one as good as family. This is far from the sorry ruin of my last visit. Yamu now plays constant host to ceremonies showing our rustic way of life, which attract many visitors with more gold than sense. Uh, a description well suited to Alexandrians. How does this sit with your faith? I confess that my thoughts are sometimes uneasy. by a gang of ruffians, huh? Silent as gifts. Uncle Bayek! Uncle Bayek! Hello, Uncle. Jewels of my life, why have you left your mother's side? Pick me up, Uncle Bayek! Ah, see now, there's no need to attack a man from behind. We're not numbering him four to one, huh? You told us to secure every advantage possible over a tender's four. Yes, yes, yes. And I am very dangerous! <laughs> Hide well, for the wanderer stalks your path! Oh, any sigil yet? Are you hiding? <laughs> you found me! You... Come away from there, Naila. You're getting in the priest's way. Be 
Beast, you will meet your end at the hands of the mighty gladiator Soris. Soris, stay back! Keba, what in the name of the gods are you doing down there? I wanted to hide, but now I can't get back out. I'm scared. Stay calm. I will help you out of there. This way. Through the tunnel. Thank you, Uncle Fire. Go straight home to your mother. She will be worried. Sina, you must come down from here. This would be a good place to watch the stars. Only the priests are permitted here. You know that. Yes, but I want to see if... Hush. Come down now. We can watch stars from the riverbank. Your father wants you to go home. <clears throat> That's the last of the children. I will tell Menehek that the children are safe. this fraud abounds in your market and you claim you can do nothing yeah. the dealings of the market are beyond me speak rather to the offending merchant <laughs> priest you have proven as false as your mummies man ahead your brood is delivered safely home thank you friend hey, what did that fool want with you some visitors Having purchased religious objects are angry when our village has no more dead cats to sell them. Though not a merchant, I am often the means by which the aggrieved snuff their anger. This matter needs a firm hand. I hope you will find some answers in the market. The merchants have short tempers and may refuse to speak. This looks like a child made it. These cat mummies are false. Oh. Greetings. I am 
You have come to the right place, Neb. We have everything you could possibly want. What I want is to ask about false idols sold at the market. I have heard rumors of such, but there is nothing to them. Now leave if you want to avoid trouble. Sold me an amulet of Hazor and my wife got sick anyway. These cat mummies are false. Tell me of the fake mummies being sold here. I have no desire to be dragged into this. Menahet sent me. Your silence is an insult to his holy office. Uh, I wish to anger neither him nor the gods. We are forced to sell items of lesser quality. Or see our stalls destroyed. Who is behind this? I can say no more now. Let us meet tonight, where the village turns to farmland. Oh, <laughs> 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 